Hello, and this is Sunny. Welcome back. Today my topic is DHCPv6. In IPv6, a device could get IPv6 addressing information in three ways: stateless address auto configuration or slack in short, stateful address auto configuration and manual. Normally we do not use manual to configure IPv6, too complicated, too much work. Slack refers to the host ability to get address information by itself. A host can also get other information such as DNS address by using neighbor discovery protocol or by DHCPv6. Stateless means no server maintains a state such as IP address assignment or list time. By default, IPv6 hosts use Slack. Stateful address auto configuration refers to the IPv6 address service are centrally managed and client and server state are maintained. Stateful address auto configuration normally works with the help of a DHCPv6 server, but keep in mind DHCPv6 server is not equal to stateful. DHCPv6 stands for Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol version 6 or Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol for IPv6. DHCPv6 is equivalent of DHCP in IPv4. It is a network protocol for configuring IPv6 clients with IPv6 prefixes and other information required to operate on an IPv6 network. DHCPv6 is used when no router is found, or if a router advertisement message enables the use of DHCPv6. Here is one example. Suppose a client on an IPv6 network wants IPv6 addressing information. It sends neighbor solicitation to a router first because the router is normally providing addressing information on an IPv6 network. But a router may reply, you need to ask a DHCPv6 server. Then the client sends solicit packet to the DHCPv6 server. Please notice the destination address FF02 colon 1 colon 2 which is reserved multicast address for all DHCP servers and relay agents on the IPv6 local network. The DHCPv6 server replies with advertise, offering necessary addressing information. Then the client sends request and the server responds with a reply. Please notice destination address uses a link local address of each other in advertise request and reply packets. DHCPv6 uses UDP port number 546 for the client and port number 547 for the server. In summary, Slack allows hosts to self-configure their IPv6 addresses. It is a default IPv6 addressing. Stateful address auto configuration normally works in a client-server model. A DHCPv6 server provides addressing information to the clients. Keep in mind, DHCPv6 can work in a either stateless or stateful way. 
A network can use both stateful and stateless auto configuration at the same time. They are not mutually exclusive. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you very much, and see you next time. Oh, don't forget to subscribe.